Phoenix Mars Lander. Phoenix Mars Lander. What do you see? Tucson Tender. LA. For the Phoenix Mars Lander. Griffin's writing his name in the court. I was at the Phoenix Mars Lander. I was at the Phoenix Mars Mission Day celebration. Do you want to write your name up there too? Sign your name. Keep going. Here, here's a good spot right, right there. Can I do it? I'll put and. Very nice on you. Let me do it the first time. Let me do it first time. Can you do it, Griffin? Want some help? Good job. Okay. All right, now, yeah, move, move that out of the way. Some help? <laughs> Go hard. You're almost there. You're welcome. Hovercraft. That's right. We have some, we have some pretty good educated guesses. Pardon? Yes, we're now going to do an experiment to see what happens when we freeze a bicycle in, in liquid nitrogen. <laughs> I say it goes faster. <laughs> Actually, we're, 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 going to, we're going to experiment with that later. But, uh, you know, we were talking a moment ago about how they're doing really cool stuff with the chemistry club across the, uh, across the way. And uh, over here, you know, the, chem the chemists know why mixing ice and salt makes it colder. But we're doing physics over here. Now, what is physics anyway? It's the science of Hi. wheel going really fast. And what do you call something that has only one wheel? Try to balance on a unicycle. You fall over. But here, once it gets going, oh, look at that! It doesn't fall over. My arm gets kind of twisted up like a rubber band. <laughs> but well, motion into linear motion, and who knows where it would end up? Do it! Do it! Do it! Probably, <laughs> probably, probably on Mars. But, uh, well, let's see what happens. And I'm here, and... Whoa! Oh, cool. Spinning around. Oh, but now it stopped. Whoa! Whoa! Cool. How's that working? Yeah. That's a good question. The pressure of the wind, the air... Do you want another awesome picture of this? Sure. You want to hold a piece of Mars? Is that really a piece of that Mars? That is really a piece of Mars. Say, grip and say, this is a piece of Mars. That is a piece of the Sagami meteorite. The time now is about 4.37 Pacific time, and we are nearing the moment we've been waiting for. Um, um, what's happening? What's up? See, data obviously is the name of the spacecraft that's in orbit about Mars, and it's actually a radio relay. So 
The lander talks to Odyssey, and Odyssey has a big antenna that talks to Earth. So it's only every two hours that it's in a position where it can see the ground where the lander is. We've now confirmed that the data stream that will contain the Phoenix transmissions is flowing to Earth property from Mars Odyssey. Uh, it's about the maximum uh, heat it's going to when it's landing, and it's been, it couldn't survive what it was expected to go into blackout, so it's, it's doing well. So I want to be kind of data and fix the things okay in 10 seconds. And now they'll tell us what it was. We have data lockup, action deployment trigger detected, heat shield trigger detected, ground up at lofty 90 meters per second. Uh, no, we're not taking any pictures on the way down. Reading off the altitude as it comes down. Standing by for land separation, altitude 1100 meters. Signal may drop out from land separation. Slow down. Altitude 1000 meters. The separation detected, we have verified the signal, ground return detected. Hey, so, so just let go of the parachute. 400 meters. 250 meters. 150 meters. 100 meters. 80 meters. 50 meters. Coming down slowly. Come on. Space detected. Up to 40 meters. 30 meters. 27 meters. 20 meters. Going back up. 50 meters, standing back for touchdown. It's slowing down, that's good. Touchdown, single detected.